So we just had a client come in and wanted us to replicate this light, but this was shot on the rooftop in Barcelona and we're in, in summer and we're in winter in the studio in Australia. So we're gonna show you how we've replicated this picture. Hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> You're the same. Well, that's the safety. I know, I'm it's a safety out. net. So as Peter said, we were asked to replicate lighting that is um, not what we have at the moment. <laughs> no, and we don't have that food near us either. No, we don't, so that's a little bit sad. But we have still set up a thing which Peter will run you through showing... Set up a thing. Set up a thing? A thing. Well, yeah, it's, well, it's a thing, isn't it? A thing. It's a thing. It's a set. A set. A thing. So he'll run you through that and showing how we can get a pretty similar light. Probably the closest thing to actually being in Barcelona on a rooftop. Mm, without the tapas. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah. 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 Cool. So what I've done is this was a, a wall that was up on the rooftop of where we were staying and we had the sun coming from behind quite steep. I think it was like a two in the afternoon type sun coming down and I didn't like what it was doing on back with her nose and that. So we've got her hard against the wall. We just got a little bit of sun hitting her head, but we had all of the paving and everything bouncing light back and lighting back. So because I was there, it makes it easier for me to set this shot up because I can remember roughly what that was like. So what I've done is I've set up a wall in around here. So I've just got a wall in the back here and I've dropped a light above and I've set the light up so there's going to be a decent bounce off that coming down to put that hair light into back. And then the rest of the light is bouncing off all of this white and filling back in. Now, the one thing I did notice in my test shots and setup shots is we still didn't have quite the same catch light. We've got quite a strong catch light in the bottom of Beck's eyes in this picture. You'll see that there. That's just the sun just gave us a much stronger light than what I could create in here. So these are my setup sh test shots. And uh, a lot of this was just really tiny little fine tuning. I didn't like, some of these just felt a little bit uplight and I really didn't like the yellow that's in the picture. I was a bit against the twisties. I was hungry. I was hungry. Um, so that was our final test shot. Now I've got the hair light where I want the hair light coming in. I've got nice bounce in here. So I think I got pretty close for my client. So the only thing I'm gonna do is now take this to black and white, but I might get back in there and get my shot that I'm gonna work on. Um, I'm shooting on the Hasselblad today. I'm at, oh, what's my settings? I'm at 400 ISO, 160th of a second at 6.3. I'm shooting with an 80 mil, which would be equivalent to around about a 62 on a DSLR. Ignore all of this stuff. I basically just moved my trigger down here so I could mount a camera on top. Um, so that's why the triggering cables look a bit weird. Okay, so I'm gonna just get my test shot maybe without the dressing gown. I was waiting for you to finish. That's all right, no, it's all right. Ooh. <laughs> good, I want sassy face, so that's a good way to start. Ah, it's cold. It's cold, is the heater on? Yeah, but it's not on the wall. Oh, cool. So I need a good shot for me to get my, that's nice, that's really cool, that's really cool. Cool, that's a nice shot to start. In fact, it could be a nice shot to finish. Just check in, yeah, everything's nice on there. So I'm just gonna now make it uh, more like the other shot that we shot, so of course, black and white, and I'm really certain I'm gonna be green channel, yep, I'm happy, I like green channel on Beck's skin. What I might do is just put a very small, down curve on just to get some more detail. So yeah, that's about where I want my down curve. I'm just gonna bring some shadow fill in to get, I wanna get some light into my blacks. So I think round about there's fine. Put a little bit of a punch with clarity, just a tiny bit. Don't have to do much. Yeah, I'm definitely happy with that. Now that I've got my setup, it's just a matter of now shooting the picture. There is, Cool, cool. We, we, even though this is a different outfit, cool. I still want. Cool, that's really pretty. Cool. You've got a tiny bit of loopsies. That's it. You fixed it. Cool. 
eyes nice nice that's really pretty so can you remember what you're thinking in Barcelona when we did the other picture um no <laughs> I reckon it might have been what are we having for lunch <laughs> maybe <laughs> maybe I just want to get a killer shot and with Beck she nails them out really easy it's cool so there's a couple that I like to start with, but I reckon I can push just a fraction more. I'm um, all about her posing out. You'll notice I don't tell her how to pose. I just like models to move naturally the way they move because then their face is going to be the most natural. And it's just a matter of getting Beck to have the right feeling or right thought other than it's freezing cold in Melbourne at the moment. And yeah, Beck's found out that, in fact, that's really pretty cool. She's definitely nailed a couple here. I might just do a quick variation. So this was based on copying the light we've done. A couple more shots. I'm really liking where you're going, except we got loopsies on this side again. That's it. Cool. That's really pretty. Cool. That's really pretty, that's really pretty. Nice, nice. Eyes just reset and bring in those eyes. Beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Yes, it is a bit too easy when you're working with Beck. Yeah, cool. I'm liking these. The one thing I might just do a slight variation, just because we've nailed this too easy. The moment we're using flash. So let's turn off flash. Let's see what I can get. Is that because of all the bounce in here? That's all the bounce. But now we've got two down lights here. We've got no window behind me, but we've got skylights, which are filling in this area. And when I'm looking at Beck, it's actually quite a nice light and I'm going to need to change my settings a fair bit. So I'm going to jump up to 800 ISO and I'm most likely going to come down yeah, 2.8. That'll be nice. This is going to be a little bit more filmic. All right, so that's with flash. That's with natural light. Now we've lost the hair light. So we've lost that completely. We've lost a little bit of the spark in her eyes. This is casting a shadow down here, but this is actually quite a nice... Look, 2.8, it's actually going to be really nice. The only thing is I might just treat this differently. Let's make this a little bit more one of my moodier, darker shots. That's cool. We'll get our black point out of here. And this is something I do a lot with my clients where I just try and give them a different variation. Cool, that shadow fill pops her up nicely. Cool, let's snap off a couple there. That's really cool. Pretty, that's really pretty. Stunning, stunning. Stunning. Cool. Pretty. Yeah, I'm liking these. These are a little bit darker, but it's giving me a, a, a sort of nice mood of natural light. Like I've lost my highlight in the hair, but I've definitely got a beautiful natural sunlighty type of picture. Cool. 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 You happy? You're doing owl noises in there. Mm. <laughs> yes, I'm happy. Okay. You happy? I don't know. I haven't seen what they look like yet. Yeah, I suppose I've got to make the boss happy. Mm. So that were the natural light ones. That's cool. Yeah. 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 And they're the flashlight ones. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're cool. I like them. You like them? They look sassy in them. Full on sass. No, no, I like them. That looks cool. Okay. You're good. You're happy with that? Thanks for watching, guys. Thank you. Oh, I should have saved a little while to put things up. Put things up. I, don't, I haven't worked out like the proximity to my head yet. That's the proximity I... to you. Make sure you can't see through the. That's why I just point around. <laughs> the proximity. <laughs> Bye.